I used to pray for you before I even knew who you were. I was never one to dream about my wedding, but I remember filling pages with prayers, asking God to surround my husband-to-be with loving people and to mold him into the man he intended for me. I didn't know when or where I would meet you, but I knew it was going to be good. Then one day I met him, my future husband. It was you. <laughs> I saw her about three or four months before I actually met her and I was asking everybody who was that new girl that showed up to play volleyball with us and nobody would tell me who it was. I think I called her without even meeting her and invited her over to come hang out and since then it's been head over heels. We met in college. Uh, my friend, uh, my best friend, maid of honor, Lana, took me to a sand volleyball game and she just asked if I wanted to play and I said sure. And so she took me to a sand volleyball game and he was on the opposite team we were playing and then we just became friends and we were friends ever since. told me shortly after they met that he was going to marry Tia and they hadn't even been on a date yet, hung out a few times and so I laughed because I thought there was no way he could pull that off and <laughs> but, but um, if you know Tyler at all then you know once he sets his mind to something he will absolutely do it um, and that's absolutely what he did. Um, I've never seen a man pursue a woman like Tyler has pursued Tia. Yeah, I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah. And I turn around and it's like, oh, it's so beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's really funny. Tia, we have finally made it. After what has felt like an eternity at some points and like a flash at others, we have finally made it to the day that will change us forever. He's gonna cry. He's only cried, I've only seen him cry once ever. Like the, all this time being friends and dating, I've only seen him cry once. And so today's the day. I'm gonna see him cry for a second time, I think. Tia, uh, I'm very excited. Um, a little emotional, but I. And I can't wait to see you here in about two hours or so. And um, I wish you would just hurry up, but I'm excited now. You're going to look awesome. And um, yeah, I think everybody else is pretty excited too. So can't wait to see you. Give you this ring. Give you this ring. As a symbol of my never ending love. As a symbol of my never ending love. And the lifetime of my vows. And the lifetime of my vows. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. The Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. And as much as you've given each other in vows and in promise, you've exchanged rings by the authority of the state of Texas and of the Lord Jesus Christ. I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Mrs. Tyler Titus. Imagine anyone more perfect to marry my best friend. 
because you exceed all of those expectations. And <laughs> Tia, you're the friend that I always prayed for and that you ever find. And you're compassionate and the biggest encourager. <laughs> you love others fiercely, and I know that this union is so blessed. Um, I've seen the Lord work in both of your lives separately, and I can't wait to see what he does with you together as a couple. Um, I love you both dearly, so here's to Tyler and Tia. Have a dream. <laughs>